Questions linger on the whereabouts of the second in command, Regadi Gashagwa, who's missed 11 state events in the last one week. Brian Mushiri reports that Gashagwa's office has not offered details of his whereabouts and even his personal mobile phone has been switched off for a while. But why? Well, is there a storm in the UDA paradise? The Deputy President Rigathe Gashagwa has been conspicuously missing state events for close to a week now is strange. Even more strange is that his office has not offered explanation for whereabouts. Gashagwa's absence when his boss, President William Ruto, hosted Ugandan counterpart Yoweri Museveni on a state visit is one of almost 11 consecutive state events that the DP has missed in the last seven days. Uncharacteristic of the deputy, who is known to be by the head of state side in all key functions. While his last public function was on Monday during a roadside engagement at Kegumo Market in Kerinyaga County, he had started on Friday last week by missing out on the national tree planting drive that saw all cabinet secretaries involved and the president planting trees in Moranga alongside Keharo member of parliament Dede Nyoro. The DP had been initially scheduled to plant trees in Bomet County, but cancelled at the last minute, long after an advance team from his office was already on ground. NTV has reliably learned that the May 10th tree planting event could have been the last stroke that broke the camel's back that is festering an ease in UDA. <laughs> the office of the DP is reported to have reached out to the air transport under the Kenya Civil Aviation Authority to get a plane for the Bomet event, but it is reported that a senior Air Force official indicated that they had orders from above not to release Kenya Air Force choppers to politicians. Then, efforts to secure two civilian choppers also hit a snag with reports that the airline owners demanded upfront payment before they release their planes. According to sources within the presidency, the events of the day at the deputy president and an exchange ensued. The DP ended up giving the event a wide berth, not even joining his boss in Moranga. Gashago was also missing in a Tuesday State House meeting when President Ruto met with KTDA chairpersons and directors where they agreed to operationalize the tea tribunal to deal with disputes among stakeholders. Reforms in tea, milk and coffee sector are the DP's pet projects having been handed the responsibility by his boss. Quite telling, in the absence of the DP, the president tasked his confidant, chief of staff and head of public service Felix Kosgei to deal with the matter. The same day, Gashagua also tasked with coordinating international partnership engagements, missed a meeting with the European Union diplomats on the signing of the Economic Partnership Agreement on Trade, Investment and Regulation. The DP also missed the swearing in of the new High Court judges and confirmment of the rank of senior counsel. Over the weekend, the DP ignited a fierce debate on the one man, one shilling, one vote debate in pushing for more resources to the populous mountain. He made the remarks during the consecration of Bishop John Kemani Figa at the ACK Cathedral of St. Peter's Mbere, Siakago in Embu County before he proceeded to address Kenyans outside the church repeating the discussion. Matters revenue sharing regarding Gashagua. Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya is a believer and a proponent of one man, one vote, one shilling. Resources are about people. The whole issue of resources is about people. The more you are, the more taxes you pay. According to insiders aware of the developments, the DP has been missing in action reportedly in his village in Madeira constituency, but unavailable to those who have tried to reach him. A UDA senator who we also inquired with called the DP and even reached out to some of his close confidants, but they too could not reach him on phone. Questions linger on the whereabouts of the second in command who has never shied away from speaking his mind in public, whether it rattled the attendees or not. The DP's absence was conspicuous when President Museveni landed in Kenya for a state visit. 
when President Museveni jetted into the country on Wednesday evening, Prime Cabinet Secretary Msalem Davadi was at hand to receive him at Jomo Kenyatta International Airport. On the same day, President Ruto presided over the pass-out parade of 4,000 KDF recruits at the Defense Forces Recruits Training School in Eldoret, Washington County, another function that the DP missed. Efforts to reach out to the head of Deputy President Communication Service have not yielded any official response. When the Ugandan president left the country on Friday, he was not escorted by Gashagwa. Rather, Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen took up the responsibility, accompanied by unlikely figure, opposition leader Raila Odinga. On the same day, President William Ruto left for Rwanda for the annual Africa CEO Forum and images of his departure were not shared with the media. A source close to the DP said he did not escort Ruto to the airport. Despite the DP being the president's principal assistant, it seems he has been fighting many friendly fires within his government. Apart from the MPs like Keharo Member of Parliament Dede Nyoro, whom he has called publicly over his inroads in the mountain, seemingly ignoring him, he has Public Service Cabinet Secretary Moses Kuria to contend with over the region's kingpin debate. Brian Mushiri, NTV, Nairobi.